Senators will please be seated. No respite for the U.S. President as once again the Democrats tore into Donald Trump's policy towards Ukraine, accusing him of criminality. The President's conduct is wrong. It is illegal. It is dangerous. And it captures the worst fears of our, founder, frame, of our founders and the framers of the Constitution. Since President George Washington took office in 1789, no president has abused his power in this way. Trump is alleged to have ordered the Ukrainian leader Vladimir Zelensky to open a corruption inquiry into the son of Trump's main political rival if he wanted his country to receive U.S. military aid. The senators have been told by the prosecution that the American Constitution isn't a suicide pact. It doesn't force them to stick with a president who threatens national security and democracy. But there are no signs that the Republicans here are losing faith in Donald Trump. They insist that the only important verdict on Trump will be delivered at the ballot box in November. I want the American people to pick the next president, not me. And so what I think is the best thing to happen is to have oversight of Ukrainian potential misconduct and move on to the election. An election that Donald Trump is increasingly confident of winning, with a poll suggesting his impeachment trial is so far failing to turn the voters against him. John Brain, TRT World, Washington.